Now, let's come to, to the last part of it. And the last part of it is making sure that the administration, Tomcat administration, is functioning properly. If you refresh the page now, you'll get the same message. Because after what you have done, you have to restart the server, server or the Tomcat server once again. You have to press on yes I would like to restart the server for in order for all of the changes to, to take effect and the Tomcat server starts to uh, take in consideration uh, the administration and compatibility modules that we have uh, inserted uh, in. Now let's go to the Apache and let's press the Tomcat administration and once damn bingo we receive this uh, administration uh, console uh, the login for it and now let's assume am I able to enter that with the root slash three x's that I've inserted let me login invalid username or password to try again click here why that? possibly because we have not yet we have to go back to the Apache Tomcat to the configuration file inside let's go to the Tomcat users XML and I said here that the Tomcat manager but I did not specify an admin so the admin and the manager are two built-in roles so if I just release Type replace the Tomcat, this one here, with the admin and the same or with the same username and uh, password, and I saved it. And then I'll go back to the Tomcat and say, Let me click here again. So I will use the rule and uh, the password. And once again, I send, I get the same thing. That because once again, I need to reload the service once again. I need to reload the Tomcat server again. For uh, Tomcat users, I've changed uh, for these changes to take effect. Let me go back and I'll go back for that. Let me say. Um, let me start going to the main page again in the Tomcat administration. And now I use the root and the triple X and let me and now I'm in. So please note that any changes you make to any of the Tomcat server files, uh, you have to restart the Tomcat uh, service once again for these two. Uh, take back. Now you can see that you are having uh, some tools for administration very similar to uh, the PHP MySQL and now uh, you can start administering the Tomcat web server. It's out of the scope now to talk about how you can manage this and uh, maybe I'll do that uh, in later on uh, tutorials. Uh, I hope uh, you get the benefit of uh, or you get any 